Absolutely. To the right, the right, the dog on the right. Okay, never mind. Cut. The cat is like green, right? Your sweet sauce work here, but. Pretty sure it's my Thai passport. Big moment. Do you have a letter opener? Oop, I don't know if you saw that. That's how the passport looks. Oh. I actually got to see if I can find some more of these. Quite the life saving kind of snack because they're quite filling. They taste delicious. The petrol service staff are absolutely. Oh, look, look at this. Get this dog on the back. That is hilarious. I had Ha Lai is, but Ha is five and La is like a uh, hundred, I guess. So Ha Lai is, is 500 baht. But as you can see, they're really great. You know, you wouldn't get this in Australia, that's for sure. You got to get up and fill it up yourself. But he makes sure he doesn't make a mess, cleans it up, takes the cash. I don't even have to bloody leave. Oh, he's a dog again! To the right, the right, the dog on the right! <laughs> Look at this fella, he's back! Look, I can try and get close. Have a look at this, guys. Only in Thailand. We've got a bloody lab black Labrador on the back. He's just chilling. No seatbelt. That is that is a class act. Oh. Yeah, no, he's definitely, no, he's a good breed of dog. I think it's a Labrador. So that breed is very, very trainable. So he's obviously like well trained, but you know, probably just for short distances around like Lamplay Mart and stuff. They're obviously not going to take that on like the M1 highway doing <laughs> 100 kilometers an hour. It's just, you know, people around here in Lam Pai Mart, they don't go 10, 15, 20 miles an hour. It's a very, very slow paced way of life. All right, let's see if we can get a park at the seven shop. What do you cup? Uh, go fast, go fast, show you cup. Uh, so, go, I need a man cup. Show, me one cup. Show, show. Thank you very much. Yeah, this has got to be an all time first. I don't think anyone's ever come with a reusable Amazon coffee cup to a seven shop to get a coffee. That's crazy. So when a Thai person gets a new car, typically it's very traditional to actually get the car blessed by a monk, have a, a some kind of like Buddha in the car, maybe some flowers or just some things to, I guess, bless the car. You know, this is very, very traditional in Thai culture. Asia's actually just fallen asleep in the back here. No food, no camera, and no pets. It feels healthy. Look at those eyes. Those are the most gorgeous eyes I've ever seen. They're nice. Really yellow. The whole, the cat is like green. If you've experienced Thailand, you'll know there's a lot of street food stalls, and typically one of the most common ones are the ones that have like either pork or chicken, kind of with sticky rice, and it's kind of like meat on a stick, maybe a bit of sauce, but that's it. Very, very simple. Now, this is basically that, but it's kind of like a like a more like done up posh version of that. So if you actually go and have a look a bit closer, you can actually see here they've got the sauces, they've got the sticky fried sticky rice, which we actually tried the other day at the market, you remember? And they've got the pork and the meat on the stick. I think it's probably mainly just pork. They've got eggs up the top and then they've also got some sticky rice. So it's kind of interesting how they've done the layout here. It's like really fancy, isn't it? And they've got like a fancy grill, right? And they've got breakfast, breakfast options as well. Five, and five, that's seven. Hopefully she needs a change. Yeah. Oh, okay, so you want that without shrimp? Uh, she can without do the it. shrimp, so that's going to make it vegetarian, right? No. Nah. Mm -hmm. Oh, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. We actually found three um, things that we could have. Wow, look at that, look at that steam coming out. That looks uh, absolutely amazing. Mmm, it's really good. It's really nice. I, I don't know if I'd be able to finish a whole lot because it's, it's a bit spicy for me, but let's taste some of these peanuts. Oh. Okay, have a look at that. Beautifully crispy and deep fried. Right. Can you hear that crunch? Just noticed that there's a sauce at the bottom. And it's a nice little sweet sauce. This soup, the mushroom is just melting in your mouth. It's unbelievable. For this meal here, 
I think what I need to do is to take one of these cabbage pieces and I need to just scoop some of that papaya salad and all of that stuff around it and just put it in there. Got the cabbage right here. A little bit, scoop a bit of papaya salad. I mean, the cabbage isn't big enough for me to scoop everything, but I'll scoop the best bits here. A little bit of bean sprout. Then we've got a little bit, a little bit of this little vegetable here. Um, obviously these peanuts, they're the best in the world, so let's scoop a bit of them. And in you go. I don't know if you're actually meant to eat it like this because the cabbage is not actually very big, but let's go for it. That is very flavorsome. So, so far, every single meal has been massive in size. Well, a good a large portion size and absolutely delicious. I'm very happy we ended up coming here today. Don't know why Asia decided to work here, but if that's what she wants to do. Here we've got the fanciest cafe Amazon we have actually been to so far. Look at this. She feel like jumping in there and going for a little swim right now. I might have, I'm going to go for a matcha. I might have the red bean. Tea. Oh, that's fine. Okay, okay. Come. It is actually not hot at all out here. The water, the water mill. Water mill. I guess we're just going to do the Instagram thing. Do you have the intention to go in every day with the same mug? When you're driving in Thailand, you're either going to get people driving really slow, like 10, 15, 20 kilometers an hour, or people doing like 120, 130 plus. I like to sit somewhere in between. Ah. What a great mascot for a pet shop. Hi. Hi. Tuna with crab stick jelly. Sorry. Damn it. I'm trying to do it all with like one hand. I just absolutely love how the pet still has cats in here. And they're very friendly too. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I want a penguin. He's good. Ah, oh, 11. Okay. Hello and Sawati Karp, friends. We have actually just started a members section on our YouTube channel. You can go to our home page and actually press the join button here. You can become a member of the Acro Voyage YouTube channel for as little as 50 baht per month to support Asia, Karina and myself. If you join up on the Pad Thai level for 50 baht, you'll get loyalty badges next to your name in the comments and the live chat and access to custom emojis to use in the comments and live chat when we do live streams. If you join the Pat Krapal membership, you'll get all the access benefits of Pad Thai, but also early access to new videos, member shout outs, photos and status updates in the private community update forum, and exclusive members only videos. And if you're feeling really generous and want to donate $7.50 a month on the mango sticky rice, you'll get all the access from Pat Krapal and Pad Thai, but also a monthly one-to-one -one private chat with myself or Corina. There are several ways to pay through debit card, PayPal, Shopee or True Money Wallet. Thank you for your support today and hope you enjoyed the video.